Alright, Josh here, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon VC 2019 Battlesbot Live series. You know what, my mind just went blank for like five seconds, I was like, what do I say next? God, <laughs> I've said it like a billion times. Oh dear me. Oh, yeah, I'm not surprised. So we are currently 17 and 14. <laughs> uh, well, well, it is what it is, isn't it? Um, yeah, I mean, this seems oh, it's not terrible. Not Geo. So is that actually... That's Geo, probably, then. Okay, so we're probably going to get wrecked, but we can uh, give it a whirl. Uh, okay. So still, still a bit... Hmm. Is there any Ultra Necrozma or just normal Necrozma? If you to Raichu, seems fine. Just want Kyogre. Probably want Necrozma as well. Yep, it caused my Ferrothorn. We yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure this is Giovanni Costa. I know he's been using. I, I I've fallen on Twitter. I know he, he uses Kyogre across my quite a lot. And literally, it does say not Geo, so that means it probably is. Mm. Or it might be someone else. Who knows? Who knows? Anyway, let's see how we get on. Uh, I have to. I, I have to be careful with Raichu a little bit. If it's yeah, and the Cosmo's a bit of a pain. But Ferrothorn's good against it. I have to just get rid of, just get rid of Incineroar, and, and Ferrothorn is just good. Okay, Incineroar, Coco, cool, cool, that's fine. I'm just gonna fake out. Fake out swapping to Kyogre? He could U turn though. Hmm. I'm going to Kyogre. I don't really see it. Okay. Just saw Steeler. Okay. That's kind of annoying because, um,. Yeah, I can't spout now. It's going to have wide guard. Oh, this is where I wish I had AV Raichu with Faint. My classic. If I had my classic Raichu now, we'd be, we'd be laughing. Or if I had Scold. Damn, Scold. I need Scold. <laughs> uh, how many times have I said that? I'm, temp I'm really tempted to swap flipping Origin Pulse out for Scold. Still do the wide guards, like for sure. But it's a bit of a mind game, isn't it? I'm gonna go for it anyway, just in case we don't. But it's like it's like 100% sure they will. Yeah. I mean, but for goodness sake, I wish I had scold. Like I'm super annoyed I don't have scold right now. Oh my god, Raichu, that's insane! But I'm gonna go into, um. I'm gonna go into Ferrothorn. There's only a really downside to going into Ferrothorn, I don't think. <sighs> that was so much damage. I wish I, I wish I had Ice Beam now, I would have got rid of the Celesteela. Oh, is this gonna do nothing? Ooh. Interesting. Right. <clears throat> Just about again. Like the mind games. <laughs> sure. mm -mm. Like, I could see Celestia switching into. Um... I don't think they'll expect me to go for it again. I don't know what it's about, just in case. Um, I get a Z by into the door. Nah, I just white guards again. Yeah, that's fair enough. I'm literally gonna do it <laughs> until. Okay. That's kind of bad. Oh, 
Try to do it again. Let's <laughs> keep our jibbles in. There's reasoning behind my madness. This house is going to be losing more than it's recovering now. You just swap cell steel out now. I can just see it happening. Yeah, snarl again, but I can see it happening. I can just I, I I'm picturing it going out. Oh, okay. Okay, that's that's actually not bad. So I think, okay, so there's no, um, there's none of Cosmo, which is nice. Yeah, boy. See, if you do it enough times, they eventually stop doing it. Right, that's really nice. That's so nice. I'm telling you, eventually, if it, <laughs> yeah, people, that, I mean, why it goes like a bit of a mind game, like, you do it so many times, and I always stop on that, if I do it like twice, and I always stop on the third, and that's the turn that, not always, but usually don't do it, so it's like, yeah, this is, this is pretty good for me. So Kyogre's important, Coco comes back out. The obvious thing is Raichu coming in, right? I'm just going to see Coco as well and swap into... Oh, I'm swapping to a Veltal. Nice Protect for the time being. I do want to switch Coco out though. Electroweb. It's probably AV Coco then. If you're electroweb. And spam? Or pulse? Spam. Oh, that's not doing much, is it? See, bringing Raichu is a little bit, not pointless, but it's not as, as uh, effective now that... <sighs> like, Eveltal's a bit of a waste of space right now, isn't it? So I can probably switch... Um... I think switches out. Like, one of them or both of them? Like, I could, I could picture, like, Kyogre switching into Incineroar, and then Coco switching out, Bolt switching into... Back into Kyogre, so I, I might. I should just power whip the Kyogre. Let's power whip. Mm. I want to power whip something. Kyogre? Coco. I'll bring in Eveltal. Eveltal's a little bit of a waste of space. It's, 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 it's not the, It's not a key mon, really, is it? At this point. And I, I want to keep. Right, I don't want to lose uh, the Sash on my tune. I don't think I've lost it. And I definitely want to get Kyogre back into, you know, like full swing. Yeah, there's the Volt Switch. Oh, right. well, that's going to be though. Okay. Oh well. You know. You can't always call it right. Cinema comes back in. Oh, this one has skull. Wrong slot though. <sighs> I thought they might swap. Yeah, like I don't know. That was a bit of an, an over predict, I guess. I probably should have just power whipped, but at the end of the day, it's fine. Okay, so so now Kyogre probably swaps into Coco. Let's sort of have one to Kyogre and just snarl. Mm 
Let's see. He's going for the Flare Blitz. That's why I swap Kyogre in. <laughs> and I get Snarl on Coco. And then I can just Origin Pulse. Bring in Raichu. And I'm fairly safe. I'm going to see Flare Blitz, yeah. That's really nice for me. Yeah, nice. Okay, now, uh, do I pulse? Or do I spout? I'm going to take Electro Web Damage, so I've pretty much got a pulse. But I, I will bring in Raichu this turn. Now's when the Raichu comes in. I'm probably going to get Electro Web, but that's fine. That's just a boost in it for Raichu. The wide guard mind games, I think, were the biggest part where, you know, on the, they did it twice and then on the third guard, I just thought, you know what, it, 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 eventually, they're not just going to sit and, nobody sits and presses wide guard for the entire game, eventually, the, the, you know, they think, oh, they're not going to press it again, they're not going to do it sometimes. But I do wish I had Scald, like, Scald, I keep wishing I had Scald, like, um, it would have helped quite a bit, but, you know, it, it's still going alright. Like, at some point, okay, that's, that's fine. Yeah, this is this is absolutely fine. As long as I connect Origin Pulse, like if I miss, it's it's gonna be a bit awkward. But like, I think we should be fine. Okay, nice. That pretty much should be the game. Yeah, and then it's just literally a fake out. Origin Pulse in it. And Fer Ferrothorn literally just wins against these two, doesn't it, really? I'm just going to fake out Coco, to be honest. There's, uh, and if Kyogre protects, I can just encore it. Yeah, GG. Well, good game to uh, Geo, if it was him. And if it was not Geo, <laughs> then good game to whoever it is. <laughs> that went alright. That went alright. It was just the, the wide guard thing was the main thing. <laughs> yep. Yeah. And I, I just, uh, like I said, I really wish I had Scald. Scald, Scald, Scald. But Origin Pulse is nice. It's just like, hmm. Yeah, it's really hard. Like, Spout's great. Actually, to be honest, on, on this team, maybe, like, Origin Pulse Scald will be better than Spout Scald. That's uh, Spout Pulse. Because I haven't got Tailwind or anything. There's, there's, there's not many times where I can just like sit and freely water spout. I can a bit if I've got Raichu, but... Oh, this is an interesting team. Oh, this is very interesting. The Sun and the Moon with Terrakion. Salamence. Okay, that's double... Potentially double Mega, so I kind of have to prepare for both. Um, the Terrakion's probably coming. I can see the Terrakion coming. So otherwise, that would be able to be Ferrothorn. Oh, well, they come with that. No, sorry, they come with Lopunny. So I, I imagine Lopunny's coming. Do I want Ferrothorn? Ferrothorn's so good against Solgaleo, though. I could go right. Mm, oh, God, actually, this is a bit awkward. I definitely want to Veltol. I definitely want Land. Okay. Yeah, I know what to do. Do I want Ferrothorn? No, I'm not, I'm not going to bring Ferrothorn. I feel like they're going to prepare for Ferrothorn and then I'm not going to bring it. Ha <laughs> ha! My chair keeps. I've got this new chair. Keep doing that. Creaking. He goes. The metal pads are on the bottom or something. I don't know. It's annoying me. It's annoying. Ermies. Erms? Ermies? Raichu Kyogre. Raichu is my. Probably my favourite Pokemon of all time. Fun fact. Alright, look. Is it though? Yeah, it is. But it's kind of Dragonite's like a very, 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 very close second. I never used Dragonite. It's not massively viable, is it? <laughs> I wish it was. I could try it. <laughs> choice Band Dragonite. Actually, Choice Band Dragonite might be quite good. Righty ho. So we've got. You know what I could do? On Call the Lopunny. Because it's going to fake out.
I, I'm, I'm literally just pressing buttons there, really. <laughs> yeah. Oh, into Raichu. Oh, that's fine. I'm just side shot. Okay. Oh, into Raichu. Oh, this is brilliant. Oh, this is great. See you later, Lopperty. You, I mean, I, I can't, I can't press protect in front of Lopperty because. 90% of the time it's going to flip an encore, so you literally can't protect him from a Lopney at all. Um, I'll bring in the Veltal now, like for sure. Yeah, I just can't protect you. You, you can't protect him from the Lopney. It's as simple as that. Terrakion. Now... There's wide guard potential on both here, so I'm, I'm just going to Dark Pulse the Lunala and just bring in Landorus just to get Terrakion's attack stat down a bit because he does have a high attack stat and Rock Slide will do a t like it will do a lot and I can't flinch let's do the main thing I just want to get rid of this Lunala so there's no like Tailwind or any of those shenanigans I mean it can Tailwind obviously but it's just side shot it's going to be side shot Rock Slide that was a crit right that's not ideal. Oh, it's Rockium! Ah. Okay, I didn't see that coming. I didn't even consider that. That's not good. That's really bad. Like creating an LB though. Do I? I don't think I can. I don't think we're gonna live this. Oh God, no way. Well, that's bad. That's very, very bad. Oh, that's awful for us. That's really, really bad. I didn't even think about Rocky. That makes sense. It does make sense. It makes a lot of sense. Um, I think I'm just going to protect Lando and Pulse, to be honest. Don't really think I've got another option. I could. Oh, I don't know. Oh, that's kind of bad. Okay. And Tailwind. Oh, we just got a side shot. Get it. Get it. I don't think he's going to get it. Oh, we do get it. Oh, let's go. Okay. This just got a dress on third. Who's your last? Salamence? Second Origin Pulse. I should Hyper Voice close combat, really, though. Wait, so they brought Lopin. They had Lopney as well. They brought both Megas? That's weird. That's into Kyogre. Oh, it's actually into Landorus. Ooh. Close combat? That was greedy. If I connect Origin Pulse, that was super greedy. Do I leave double edge? I should do. I should. Be. That was that was that was not necessary. They, honestly, if they just close combat, they would have won. That was a little greedy. I mean, I should live a double edge. Unless it's like max. Yeah, got it. That was a really unnecessary sword stance. Like that was really greedy. They should have just gone for the close combat. And honestly. Close combat plus. I mean, because I, I had two origin pulls, really. Um, maybe they thought I'd ice beam and then they can plus two close combat me, but I couldn't really risk it. I had to just go for it, didn't I? Like, I'd rather take a. I would rather take a close combat or a double edge for a Mega Salamence. So it's kind of. <laughs> they're both not ideal, really, are they? To be honest. Yeah, look at that! We got past the mid 1500s! Right. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Alright. Oh, I said the classic. I feel like I've not had it for a bit. 
It's really like last episode I had it on. Roger! Roger that, sir. Primitively. That's, a, that's an interesting team. Also with Raichu, uh, but Breviary and um, Rotom Wash is pretty interesting. I think Rotom Wash could be pretty pretty, pretty good still. I, I, I doubt it's coming to this game. That's that's for Groudon's. Um, but Breviary could come, which is not ideal. What I could do is go Landris Eveltal and foul play it. Maybe. Now who do I want? Ferrothorn or Scissor? I think... Mm, actually, I don't know. Scissor, maybe? I could maybe go Scissor in this. Raichu Veltal? I like going Raichu Veltal. Should we go Scissor? Oh, wait. How am I good? No, ha wait. Let me think. I need to beat the Rake. Do I want any Veltal? Let's go. Let's do that. Trust me, I have a plan. No, oh, this is actually a little bit awkward. We'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. Interesting having Raichu on like a Xerneas team with with Rayquaza. Raichu Rayquaza. Well, mm. this is not great for either one of my Pokemons, isn't it? Is it? Is it? Who did you fake out? Who did you Dragon Ascent? Fake out one Dragon Ascent, the other. I need to keep Scissor around. Fake out Kyogre? I'm gonna protect. Oh, I could, I could Ice Beam. I could Water Spout, actually. I think you go for Scissor. And I'll, I'll go into Raichu. I think you go for Scissor because, like, it's more of a threat to, um... Xerneas. Like, you probably fake out Kyogre and Dragon Ascent. Or you might even just want to Volt Switch or something and Dragon Ascent Scissor. Or just fake out Scissor and Dragon Ascent it. Maybe I rushed into that a little bit. <laughs> I rushed into the button clicking a little fast. Maybe thought about the different... Scenarios. A bit trigger happy, maybe. Need to keep Scissor around, though. We just lose to Xerneas otherwise. I am water spouting, but it's because I want to bring Raichu down a little bit. If you just drag an ascent, it's bad. I think we go for Scissor, though. I really think we go for Scissor. Okay, there's a fake out. Ooh. Okay, so it's AV, right? That's nice to know. Well, Raichu's pretty useless now, which is nice. So I can fake out... Um, Great Plaza. Oh, no. I don't click that. And just um, Origin Pulse. Actually, no, I can spout, actually. Um, no reason not to, really. I actually can't really do anything. The worst it can do is, what, faint? It's not going to faint. <laughs> Icy Wind Rayquaza. That's AV then. You won't run Icy Wind on any other ray, I don't think. What's Raichu gonna do here? Encore. That's kind of alright, okay. So we can pretty much suspect that it's probably focused on Raichu. Which it is. Um, That's definitely AV Ray, by the way. I mean, they kind of force me. Oh, 
Ah, this is so obvious, but I'm gonna have to do it. Because they can like nuzzle me or something now, but I will get an intimidate down. And if it's AV Ray, usually they haven't got as much attack investment, which is nice because it means I can probably live a Volt Switch plus a. Dragon Ascent. I mean, I should live this now. Helping Hand Raichu. Fake out Helping Hand Encore. It's gotta have full switch. That does a lot. Right, so I'll swap back into Raichu now. And I'm just gonna rock slide. Can Landers live? Yeah, I mean, that should be f this should be fine. I, d I don't really want to lose Kyogre. I never really want to lose Kyogre. And I definitely don't want to lose Scissor. So I need to bullet punch that Zero. And if it's. Who else did they have? Um, Rotom Wash, Braviary. Do they have Incineroar? This is going to be Incineroar, isn't it? Was it Incineroar? It's got to be. My choosing Ray, Braviary, Rotom Wash, Incineroar. I think it was Incineroar. Probably. Yep. This is going to Lando. I would imagine. I sh I, honestly, I should. I've got, like. Ooh. Not really what I was expecting, but. Oh, I actually lived that. That's that's pretty impressive, right? You, I'm not gonna lie. Right, well, that kind of seals it because whoever is in the back is kind of fine. Um, yeah, there's Incineroar and Xerneas. Yeah, I'm gonna fake out Z. Um, Incineroar. I know that means Xerneas can get its boost, but I'll just beat it with um... Scissor. Actually, no, this is actually... No, I can do this. Let's fake out Xerneas. And then... Um, and uh, and Z. Incin. Into Raichu. Oh no, okay. See, this means I can get a nuzzle on Xerneas now, which is, you know, always kind of handy. Let me just get rid of this Incineroar. With a Z. And then Scissor should be able to clean up. The nuzzle's always nice. Just, you know, just for a little bit, bit of chip. I wanted to chip it a little bit, because I know, like, Plus two bullet punch doesn't always out Carl Xerneas. It does most. It depends on the spread. I, th I, I put enough investment into just to um, get like no bulk ones pretty much. But if it's got some bulk, it will, you know, be able to take it. So the chip will help quite a bit. It's a bit oh, I mean, the power will be amazing now. I just moonblast. That should be into Landorus, really. Yeah, but I, I, you know, I'll love this for sure. Yeah. Well, it still did quite a lot, really, didn't it? Oof. And this should get Incineroar. I did put enough attack investment in Lando to Oko Incineroar with the Z move at Neg 1. Which I believe I'm at. I believe. I believe. Oh, I believe in God. I don't really know that reference. Did come on if you do. Yep, that's gone. And yeah, that's that's uh, that's pretty much the game now, isn't it? I can just um don't really know, really. Keep nuzzling, rock sliding. It doesn't matter. As soon as one goes down, I get scissor, and then that's it, isn't it? So I check out of earthquake, even it, it doesn't really matter. I just need to get one sword stance up, and then um, Zernis is dead. So that's uh, that's ideal. To be honest, like if I was my opponent, I probably would have just geomanted there because it's the only you, it's, you're only really out in a way. Like moonblast isn't going to save you. You have kind of got to. They should have geomanted. I would have geomancy. Like a last ditch effort. 
Let's go for the power flinch. That's not bad damage, is it? That's definitely in bullet punch range now, plus two. Now it gets bad. I, I am gonna. I might, I might just bolt switch now. Into scissor. I mean, there's, there's literally nothing that can. Something that can really go wrong. Yeah. Clearly annoyed by that, <laughs> by that power. But, um. Yeah, Scissor, Scissor would have just cleaned that up. It's a bit of a shit. I kind of wanted Scissor to get the get the KO, get the bullet punch KO. Um, so yeah, that was a fairly successful episode. Uh, did I not pause that at all? No, no edits on this episode. That's even better. That means it's even more successful. Saves me time. And uh, yeah, we'll carry on on Wednesday with this team. I'm quite enjoying it so far, but it's been alright, hasn't it? Um, maybe a bit of a ropey start. But I feel like we're we're kind of getting into a bit of a, a rhythm now with it. And yeah, cheers for watching guys, take it easy and I'll see you all in a bit.